So it's 41 degrees over here in Illinois. I am, uh, let me flip the camera real quick. Fishing, I don't know if you can see my poles. This is how I do my catfishing. Yep. Chilling in my truck, it's nice and warm in here. Kind of a mess a little bit. I brought my uh, cool ass backpack with me for some uh, bass fishing. That's not beer, that's a fucking root beer me and my son bought yesterday. But uh, yeah, it's a little chilly out. So I'm not, I don't know if I'm gonna do any bass fishing. I got one catfish already. I'm just waiting on some more. I had a little secret weapon yesterday. I threw a big ass thing of uh, some rotten, stanking green pork butt into this lake over here. And it's not working as good as I thought it would. I really thought there'd be a lot of action going on over here. And maybe it's a, maybe I'm too close to the port, but maybe that's what it is. Because, I mean, this thing was huge. It was like, it was like, like three or four pounds. It's, it's pretty freaking big. And it was bad. It was fresh and it was bad. It wasn't Walmart bought or department store bought. Like, it came from a farm, and it went bad. So, I don't know if you've ever smelt fresh bad pork, but there's a difference. Pork smells, when it's fresh from the farm, it has kind of a piece. Some people think it's bad, but it's not. It's because the bone has a funny smell to it. It's kind of, if, you, if you never lived that kind of lifestyle before, like, you wouldn't really know, but kind of has a little bit of a different smell but this was bad this wasn't this wasn't pork smell this was fucking disgusting it was the worst smell almost I've ever smelled but yeah stay tuned we're gonna get some more catfish today